how's it going everyone? Be humble here and welcome back to some more Tears of the Kingdom. In the last episode we just started off the game, we're kind of getting used to things again and I was wandering around in between episodes just to see what's here, pick up a couple more branches and to the left of the map over here there was this place that we haven't gone to. A wooden stick that kind of looks like a sword. <laughs> looks like a crafting table of sorts maybe? All right, so nothing really over here, just the house. And I did learn that you can actually swap controls. Um, you had the ability to change that. So you can swap your jump controls with uh, X and B there, which I am doing. <laughs> because that actually helps quite a bit. So now my run button is X and my jump button is B, which to me makes more sense. Maybe not to other people, but it makes sense to me. <laughs> All right, uh, I think we were in here already, yeah. Uh, I guess I need to use this to activate a bridge. Yep. So I guess I am trying to make my way down to that scary looking temple time. I feel like I'm gonna battle something. I feel it. Apples! Um, who you be? Hello, you seem to be new here. Be wary of soldier constructs as they travel this way. Soldier constructs are those of us given strict orders to protect this land. The Zonai who created us directed them to eliminate trespassers. They will consider you a trespasser too. You must treat them as a serious threat. Allow me to offer unsolicited advice. It is crucial to maintain a proper distance and target your opponents. Swinging haphazardly will not yield results. Well, I kind of did that right. Whoopsie. It's a floating cube in the back over there. I think that's a floating cube. You may practice targeting on me if you want. Oh, but please do not actually attack. Yeah, don't worry, I won't attack you. Oh, another wooden stick. Uh, I do not want to do that at this very moment. Can I? Oh, oops. Oh, bye bye. Whoopsie. I will take all your apples now. Okay, that's how you put that away. Okay. Oh, look, more apples. All right. Don't worry, I'm not gonna hit you. What's this though? Oh, this is like the. Oh my god, what'd you call those? Are they the guardians? Oh, who are the things that attacked you in the previous game? Uh, I guess we're jumping again. Yippee! Oh, hello. Oh, the belly pop's gonna hurt. Alright, landed another pond. So, my heart tells me to go this way. But my brain tells me to go the other way because there might be stuff over there. I guess I'll use my wooden sticks up. Ouch. Ouch. I was trying to throw it. I don't think it really worked. So I think there's also a button now. You can actually eat things. Did that work? Select. Yes. Ah, oh, do I still have to go into the menu and eat it? Oh, those are quarters and halves. Okay. Well, 
All right, well, that didn't go as I wanted to. Oh, it's misty up here. What the heck are you? I can't target it. Well, let me target it. Wait, no, come back. I want you. I don't know what the heck you are. I want you in my life. And it's gone. Okay. That was interesting. Oh, that was so weird. Okay. I want to name it Bill and I want it to be my friend. That's that's all I want. I just want Bill to be my friend. But apparently Bill is not my friend. Oh, another one. Can I like sneak up on them? Oh, he's too, he's too good, he's too good. He's too good. He's too good for me. Don't fall off the island though, bro. Please. Don't do it, man. Don't do it. I wanna I want be your friend. Stop, stop. <laughs> Come back. Come back, Phil. Or Bill, I forgot what I named you. I don't think I can interact with <laughs> All right, so unfortunately, I think the last eight minutes of footage started to get super laggy. I uh, didn't notice it for a bit, uh, but I'm not sure how much of it I lost. I don't think there was anything too important besides like us finding this fire here and getting closer to the temple of time. Uh, so sorry about that. Hopefully I can keep as much of that footage in as possible. OBS is just not loving me today, apparently. It's like you're back? Well, I'm gonna make your life miserable. Thanks, OBS. I love you. <laughs> but regardless, let's continue up here. I think I started to also explore like this area over here, but it seems like that area is kind of like off limits to me and it has a lot more um, enemies and stuff that maybe I need specific gear for. We'll find out. Oh, hello. Oh, you have a shield really? Ow! Rude. Of course. Um, you know what? Pokey stick. Ooh, a broadsword. Oh, I love that for me. I could use a shield again. Alright, so we got that. He wasn't too bad. Uh, I kind of want to keep the stick on hand, just in case. <laughs> Anything over here? Any secrets? If I go around here... <laughs> just asking for death or is there secrets? <laughs> oh, I'm asking for death apparently. <laughs> Whoopsie. Sorry, Link. <laughs> so that's what happens if you fall off. <laughs> okay. Deletes a heart. Um, maybe this was a bad idea. I don't see anything. So let's, let's uh, go back. No, Link, hey. Let's just go back. Go back to safety. I like how the immediate reaction of Link is to dive into the abyss. <laughs> At least he takes his death's head on. <laughs> All right, I should probably heal myself up after that blunder. All right, let's see what this is, I guess. Is 
Zone had crazy hands, apparently. Oh. Oh, access denied. That door will open only to those with sufficient power. Oh. I'm sorry. I did not intend to startle you. It was I that spoke to you earlier. That arm originally belonged to me. Whoa, you know, I like the Zonai. Raru, was it? Forgive me for appearing to you in this manner. Unfortunately, I no longer have a physical form. In any case, that arm should allow you to open this door. It seems to have lost the power to do so. He has so much hair. You might be able to restore it, but you would need to enter a place filled with sacred light. Uh, of course. Why not visit the shrines on this island? Oh, back to the shrines. Oh. Different looking shrine. The shrines. Yes, I'm sure they are the key. Alright, very similar vibes to uh the king from the first game when we realized he was no longer alive. Okay, so now we're gonna go over there. Oh, I have to set the don't I? Oh no, it is set. Hmm. Oh, I guess I just dropped down. Oh, ouch, that was a bad idea. But yeah, I started coming over this way before and then realized it was a bad idea. <laughs> oh, I did get a, air, a bow and arrow though. Like, I came up over this way because I was like, hmm, what is up here? And up here... It looks like something out of Sonic. <laughs> like, it looks like I need to ride down this rail. <laughs> Which I probably do. Um, quite honestly, there's probably a power for that. But it seems I can go down this way. And it looks like I have to take these, uh, constructs out. Let me actually eat food again. Expect me to be healing a lot because I am going to be horrible at this game. <laughs> Where is he? I heard robot. Where is robot? Where is he? Oh. Oh, goodbye, long stick. Ooh, he had arrows on him. Try out the arrow mechanic again soon. I honestly forget how the arrows work in this game. Is there anything over here? Just curious. If there's nothing, I'll just go back. But I'm just like, I feel like there's secrets. And I need to find the secrets. <laughs> But it honestly doesn't look like there's anything over here besides rocks and water. So alright, I will I will go back. I will behave. I'll behave like the good little gamer that I am that I am. <laughs> alright, so we gotta go up there to the glowing giant rock. The heckles is that. What? Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm confused. Is that just signaling it's about to go to nighttime? 
Maybe. Maybe it sounds like I hear night noises. <laughs> so this looks like some sort of dam. Oh, that's the edge of the world. <laughs> Let's not go down there. My curiosity is going to kill me at one point. I know that. I 100% know that. It already happened. It's going to happen again. It's going to happen multiple times. Mushrooms! I forgot about those. I feel like you get these very early on. I feel like the mushrooms were like much late game. Oh, 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 oh. Why is like so sweaty? Down, down, boy. Hmm. It's gonna be a way to get over there at one point, isn't there? It's gotta be. I'm just gonna climb on up. Yuko's Shrine. So I wonder if all the shrines are gonna be like this mechanic now? Or are we gonna go revisit shrines that we did in Breath of the Wild? I'm curious how that's gonna Oh, that is cool. I like this. <laughs> it kind of looks like a sweet potato. <laughs> I don't, I'm not gonna lie. This temple looks like a giant sweet potato. <laughs> a giant green flame sweet potato. <laughs> Anyone else get sweet potato vibes? Because I am. <laughs> Ooh, this screen's nice. I kind of do miss the simplicity of the original loading screens, though. It was very much as Temple of Time feels to it. Oh. oh, so you made it here. I thought he was going to speak. This is a shrine of light. Long ago, I filled these places with light that purges evil. I believe this light will restore an ability your arm has lost. Mm -hmm. Now then, extend your hand. <laughs> so I guess this is gonna be like in place of our Sheikah Slate abilities. Ooh, pretty. Ultra. <laughs> Oh, that's funny. Grab them with objects, rotate them, and stick them to other objects. Oh! Mm. This is the Ultra Hand ability. It allows you to move objects freely and attach them to other objects. With it, you will be able to build a great number of things, really anything you can imagine. Mm. Use Ultra Hand and receive the blessing from this shrine. Ooh. So I definitely need to use this is kinda like oh, oh, oh. Oh. there we go. I wasn't rotating before. How do I Oh Okay. Am I over this? Okay, did it. This is gonna take some getting used to here. <laughs> that real quick. Uh, what am I doing here? Okay. Do 
have to stick them together? Is this what it is? Do I stick them together now? This is hecka confusing. <laughs> oh, interesting. Oh, all this is interesting. So I can move this as a bunch now. Okay. Alright, I did it. Trial and error, but I got it. Oh, just barely made it. Um, is there any treasure chests in this area? Probably not since this is tutorial stuff. What is that thing on the ceiling though? Oh, hello, a shiny thing. that was supposed to do. <laughs> it's fixed. Oops. Is that supposed to do something? Was I supposed to touch it? I'm so confused. Oh wait, am I supposed to like... Make this a platform? supposed to how do you unstick something oh my god that's adorable am I supposed to do this okay that's stuck Shake it, it comes off. It's so cute. Wait, I need a I need to flip this. I realize the error of my ways. I need to flip this guy. <laughs> I need to flip you. 
gonna get there, guys. Don't worry. I mean, it works. So if I do this and put myself on it... Oh gosh, I think I need to turn the other hook. <laughs> yeah, I need, I need to fix this hook. I'm getting there, guys. I swear. Uh, okay. That didn't work. Okay, it automatically goes. Okay, I like this. <laughs> Figured it out eventually. <laughs> I like how I put the hook back on where it's supposed to be. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. That's not a monk. Or is this just like a blessing of the sky? Wah. You've done well to reach this place. We offer this light that will cleanse you of evil. Uh, so this is the zone that married the first Hylian princess. So they fixing my arm that was hurt. All right, is this in exchange of the um? Oh my god, it's not tokens. Oh my god, what do they call them in the other game? Were they blessings? I don't remember. But it's very similar mechanics. I don't know if all of these shrines, these type of shrines, will replace the monk shrines. I'm assuming so. Safe skydiving. <laughs> that is an oxymoron. You did very well getting through that shrine, and you restored an ability. This is wonderful. If you visit and complete two more shrines, you should be able to open the door to the Temple of Time. You may want to mark the shrines with distant pins, then you'll never lose track of where they are. Well, can you show me? Uh, the purr pad offers a very useful scope. It's quite handy. So you're gonna leave it up to me to figure out where they are. Okay. So basically you gotta look for giant glowing things. Hmm. Oh, there's one. Where's number two? Where's the second one? Oh, up there. Oh my god, these seem very far away to reach. <laughs> uh, hmm. I feel like... I'm not really sure where I should go. <laughs> I guess maybe I need to go back to that tower that had that crazy contraption and make my way down to this shrine? I guess so. Oops. So let's go back over here. 
Oh, can I warp here now? Mm, don't think warp points are a thing yet. Hopefully they're a thing in this game. I'm sure they are. I probably just can't unlock it yet. Well, this makes sense now with all the stuff I need to build. Well, actually, can I get across this if I stick things together? Oh, I have an amiibo. Amiibo one now, too. Okay, that should hopefully be enough. Just barely made that. Barely made that. Is there anything over here, though? Anything of interest? This seems suspicious. Like, I should be able to pick up a rock and throw it in a Korok pops out of nowhere. Do I have to also get over there? Assuming I had to build another bridge. Let's see though. I think my hunch is right. There is stuff down there that looks suspicious. <laughs> uh, let me try this though. I'm assuming I need to build a bridge from like this rock to that rock. Ho oh, oh, ho oh. ho! Almost lost my bridge. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I don't know if this was correct. If I had another way of getting over here, but I did it. Proud of myself in that respect. <laughs> Korok! Oh, you're not Hetsu. But you see me. I don't know. I don't know if someone like you could see the children in the forest. Well, if you see Hetsu, please return this to him. So we do Korok seeds. Oh, and my friends and I are hiding in lots of different places too, so you should keep an eye out while you wander. Oh, we're back to this again. <laughs> back to this. I will take this apple, though. Alright, so at least there was a Korok seed up there for me to take. Oh, I could have got up here a different way? I feel like, no, I couldn't have. Well, maybe? I'm so confused. Where am I? <laughs> Who am I? Why am I? <laughs> Alright, I'm 
assuming we can craft things with those later. I don't see too much else. I don't think I'm missing anything. Hopefully not missing something. I don't think I'm missing anything though. There's nothing else here besides this Korok. <laughs> So besides this dragon that's just been in the sky this whole time. Uh, but I think with that, I'm going to call it an episode here. And I'm going to go back to that place where we had to kind of build a ramp that we saw. Like we did in the shrine. So I'm going to go back there and we'll pick it up uh, next episode. So thank you guys for watching. And remember to stay kind and be humble.